guys, welcome back to another video. So today we're going to show you how to do some chilindrinas mexicanas, uh, which is using one of these right here. Um, they're like duros de cuadro, which is a square flower snacks. Um, basically, it's like a snack for you to um, have during any day of the week. So very simple and very basic ingredients here. I do have one cucumber and I'm only using a little bit amount of ingredients just because it's only going to be for me and the husband. So we are using one of the cucumbers and one tomato and just I cut maybe half or less of the cabbage and we are going to shred our queso fresco and we are using some mayonnaise whichever mayonnaise you want to use and we are using the cueritos which is um the pork skin it's the pickled pork skins so to top it off we are using our homemade salsa and some sour cream so that's what we're using for this recipe and with these um we are going to fry them up in oil so stay tuned for the full recipe and don't forget to give this video a like and don't forget to subscribe for more recipes and I do want to say thanks for the new subscribers and my old ones for keeping up with me um, showing you my recipe. So let's get started with the process. Today my husband is helping me out with this recipe. Um, so what we are doing, we're just cutting up our tomato. Okay guys, um, before I start to show you how to fry these up, I know that there's some, um, one of these snack um, churros, doritos that are bigger. But for us, we are using th this size. So it depends what size you want to use. But for me, it's kind of perfect. We're just going to um, prepare these um, doritos. Here. So yeah. So next we are doing the cabbage. Next is going to be our cheese. So we are going to shred the cheese up. Next is going to be our avocado. So we're just going to chop them up in pieces or if you want them in slices, it's up to you guys. So next is our pickled pork skin and we're just going to chop them up in pieces. Okay guys, so here we have every, our ingredients that we're going to be using. As you saw, we did um, do our cucumbers, our pickled pork skin, queso fresco, cabbage, tomato, and our avocado. So now the next process is going to be to start frying these up. So you do want like a, a medium high heat to fry these up. So let's get started with that process. So the husband, what he's doing is, because you know these um, um, churros, they fry up so quick. So he's just using the spatula to control it. So your um, doritos come out as much as extended as possible. So that's just a tip for you guys, if you guys want to do it that way. Because if you let it um, just cook in the, the oil by itself, it's just going to curl up. So you see how it came out perfect? So that's what you want. And you have to be careful when you put them in, so just slide them through so you won't burn yourself. So there you have it guys, that's how they came out and perfect, perfect size. So this is how you slide them down so you won't burn yourself. And just keep the spatula kind of controlling it so it won't curl. This is how they came out. Really nice and beautiful. And be careful because they are hot. Um, now what we're going to do is we're going to add the mayonnaise onto the surface here. And then we're just going to start adding our ingredients into our Doritos. So that's our next process, guys. So we're going to use the little um, bread. Mm -hmm. 